Donner and Blitz. But do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? Just Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny nose. And if you ever saw it, you would even say it goes. All of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back and today I'll be showing you how to change the theme of your blender manually. Let's get started. Okay guys, so let's begin by going to the top corner and clicking edit at the top. And then scroll down all the way to preferences and then click that. Okay guys, so this is not the same as blender 2.79 so I'll be showing you what to do with that. So what you guys actually want to do is once you get here, you want to click outside the box and then go up to the corner, click file, then go to user preferences, then click it. Okay guys, now this should pop up and you should be on the themes tab, not the add-ons, not any other one, just the themes tab because that's what we're working with today. Okay guys, we are back on Blender 2.8 and 9. Make sure that you are not on any other tab but the Themes tab like we did for Blender 2.79. Just make sure you're on the Themes tab. And yeah, so basically you can just put this in full screen if you like. But what I'm going to do is leave it in the tiny screen so you guys can see what the changes are. So guys, the first thing you actually want to do is go over to User Interface. And then when you click it, scroll all the way down until you see icon color then as you can see it shows these colors now what you want to do is click on one color and just change it to whatever you want as you can see it changed something in the corner over here it changed it to a green icon so it makes a difference as you can see um yeah so you guys want to just keep changing the color and you'll be seeing the difference of what it makes I'm going for green theme in this and like I'm using colors that match the green theme. As you can see over here I'm just showing you the colors that I used and what they did. So yeah. Okay guys, I don't know if you realized, but while I was changing the colors, it changed the icon colors near the properties at the bottom. And yeah, so I'm just trying to show you guys that the trick actually works. It may take a while like it did for me when I made my own theme. It was a bit pink, but yeah, it did take a while, but it's worth it. After I was done, what I did was actually close up icon colors and then scroll all the way up to the top and open up regular. Then I started changing the text color and what this does is, is change the text color to any color you want. I chose Y because it stands out from green. Okay guys, as I said before, this may take a while, like it took me before because my theme was kind of pink and it was kind of worth it because I knew I learned how to make something at least and yeah. So guys, um, as I said before, my theme is green and this is exactly the same for 2.79 and 2.9. I think you guys have the hang of it, so I'm just going to speed this up and show you how to save your theme later. By the way guys, you do not want to miss where I show you how to save the theme because that bit is super important or else you lose all of your progress and you'll have to start again. So I'll be showing you how to do that later and I'll leave the timestamps in the description and in the comments so you guys can skip all the way to the place where I'm showing you how to save your theme. So yeah. Okay guys, to save your theme, what you want to do is scroll all the way up to presets. Make sure you are on the themes page, 
Then click the addition button next to the word presets and I'm going to name mine work in progress green theme or something along the lines of that. Now the next thing you need to know guys is that you have to keep on saving your project while you go along because it doesn't save automatically and when you finish your theme completely you can always delete other themes so yeah and you guys if you come off your theme it's all right because you can still click back onto your theme like i'm showing you it right now and yeah that's all i need to tell you guys at the end i'll be showing you one of the themes that i've made before and yeah